Hey guys, it's Erica. We're going to be checking out G-Friend Flower. I am excited for this. This is a Japanese release for them, so it's really cool that they're uh, promoting, like, in Japan and stuff, and that they're making, like, original tracks in Japanese for the Japanese fans. That's really dope, really cool. I'm really excited to be checking this out. I love G-Friend. So, yeah, I have no idea what to expect for this. I think somebody requested this, like, a long time ago, and I remembered when I was pulling down videos for um, reactions, and then, um, I saw it, and then, like, I was, like, and I checked the date on it. I'm like, whoa, I'm gonna be way late. But, um, here you go. So, you know what? Let's go. Ooh, look at that pink. Oh, this is how they do the Latin thing? Her earrings kind of look like bacon. I love the, like the room. It's so pink and just so pretty. Ooh, that's stained glass though. Those yellow dresses though. I think it's interesting to hear the Latin pop done in this way. They kind of look like princesses, though. Um, their outfits. Um, not the yellow flower ones, but the other ones. Because I think because when we've seen how K-pop groups, well, this is for this is Japanese, so kind of counts a little bit, but they're because they're K-pop group. Anyways, how it's been done is like a. How should I say? Like, they take it on like a sexy concept, so seeing it this way is interesting. It is like if they, if there was like, oh that was a cool transition. They're like Disney princesses. That's like what it reminds me of. I don't know if it's the colors or the certain or the outfits or what. They they kill in the choreography though. G, we don't even have to talk about G friend and choreography. Remember? Okay, that beat though. All right. Oh, like, is that salsa inspired? A little bit there? Salsa g style? Now I'm trying to figure out what genre they kind of pulling from. I can't really tell. Probably a genre I don't really listen to, I'm not very familiar with. Am I the only one that gets, like, Disney Prince style vibes? I do like how they have like the Latin pop inspiration with like that G friend sound is very unique, very cool. And that abrupt ending, I wasn't ready for it. But yeah, that was G friend flower. So the flow of Japanese was really cool, really nice. Um, the sound again, just pretty much like Latin pop G friend style. I I, I can't think of like specific genres that it pulls from within like that Latin pop world. Um, because there's a lot, um, probably, again, like, one I'm not really, like, used to hearing, and again, like, their outfits kind of reminded me of, like, Disney princesses, except for those yellow flower ones, I don't know why, and then that pink, like, ballroom, like, Disney princess vibes, like, I don't know why, but, um, yeah, but I enjoyed it, it was really cool, really interesting to sort of hear that, um, but yeah, because, I, I, because I kind of didn't think that G-Friend would do, like, 
um, a Lion Pop inspired sound in their things, but it, it worked really well. It was really cool. Really G friend styles. I like that breakdown during like the bridge with how that beat went. That was really cool choreography. They killed that choreography. Like, oh my god, that was crazy. So, yeah, I really enjoyed it. Go to your thoughts in the comments below. Do you thought about G friend's flower? If you liked this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and want to see more of my videos, go and hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos, the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, tell my Facebook page, all the description down below or at the end screen. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I'm